Kontifa. Kontifa. <laughs> yeah, the gut. The gut's good. Oh, hey. Yeah. Ferret. Woodpat, the ferret. And he's a lovely boy. Oh, I love him so very much. He's daddy's boy. Now, I don't have much battery on my phone, or much uh, memory left on my phone, so it'll be a quickie. Salmon oil to the stomach. He'll start licking it, as you can see. And he'll be totally preoccupied with that. Um, my normal pair of shears, or um, for, for clipping his nails, has gone dull, but uh, this kind of thing is also usable. I do recommend buying a, a proper one now. I hope you'll be able to see. He's now preoccupied. And this one, he has a tendency to grip my finger. That doesn't make it easier. But then you just go cut. And you take care to not cut into the colored bit. Because that will hurt him. And he'll bleed. And I don't want my boy to bleed. I love him more than anything else in the world. Yeah, the god scared. And he's still preoccupied. It's all good. And the last one. Yeah. Run he There you go, the last one I cut slightly too much off, but not enough for him to bleed. There you go. Um, I don't often cut the claws on his hind legs. It's usually not necessary. But sometimes when they get a little sharp and pointy, I do. There aren't now, because it's only a month since I cut his nails last. His, uh, his nails, claws, grows really fast. Look at him. This is daddy's cute boy. And he's licking salmon oil from his stomach and that totally preoccupies him. So you can basically do what you will with his nails. Of course, this one is a very, very easy one. He's such a, so mellow. He's such a good boy. He'll want daddy time and he sleeps at, at, in bed with me at night. Um, so I generally can do whatever I want to him. But it works also on hybrids, etc. I have had hybrids, um, so that's how you do it. Yeah. Daddy's boy. I hope that helped.